I'm off to Singapore to look at its biophilic building. What's that? Biophilic cities, according to Tim Beatley in his fabulous book, is about bringing nature into the daily life of ordinary city dwellers, which means you have to build it into the way you build the city. And that is new because there's a whole lot of new techniques and technologies with green roofs and green walls and green edges. And we are trying to find the innovative edge in this area. And I think it's Singapore. Now I had to convince Tim Beatley to come with me and I'd really sold Singapore. So he's coming for a week. We have to check out a whole lot of case studies, meet a lot of people, do some interviews. It's going to be very intense and we hope to have a sense of whether Singapore really is the biophilic city of the future. We've got a bit of help. Some of my students, in fact 35 students from the National University of Singapore who are studying a Masters in Urban Design uh, and they're doing a course with me and Tim are going to help us. And this combination, we hope, will unfold the secrets and mysteries and wonders of Singapore as a biophilic city. I mean, the ideal thing would be not just city in a garden, but city in a forest. And that would be like the aspirational thing that we want to do, you know. I was actually uh, inspired by uh, the St. Paul's in Notre Dame, uh, Gothic uh, architecture, with the, the amount, kind of, the, the grand space that they have. Loving plants is, is the most important thing that, I, that everyone has to do, because if you don't love plants, this is going to be the end of civilization. <laughs> I think the most proud aspect of this project is that I'm doing a difference to the patients in creating a healing environment for them. <laughs> oh, of course, that is the main purpose. I mean, to get people close to nature.